India is an adventurous paradise. You head out for a holiday, which quickly turns into a survival situation. A dream turns into a nightmare. I'm thirsty, I'm tired, I'm hungry and I'm lost. Shelter, water and food become a priority. A fire to keep you warm. But how? I'm Chandan Lahiri from OTS Survival School. I'll give you some tips and show you some tricks to use in a self-reliant situation. Do not think problems can only happen to other people. It can happen to you. An important part of hiking, of trekking, of being in the wild outdoors is to know where you are, is to know where you're going. If I look all around me in a 360 degree panorama, there are pretty much no landmarks that one can recognize to show where one came from and where one is headed. To figure out which side is north, south, east, where the cardinal points, cardinal directions. What do you use? Is a wristwatch. Wristwatch? Yeah, you use a wristwatch. You're wearing an analog wristwatch, better. Using an analog wristwatch and using the sun, how to tell directions. According to your watch, it is a little after two o'clock in the afternoon. The sun is to our right. And there's the hour hand, which is pointing to a little after two o'clock. What you do is take the hour hand, point it to the sun. Yeah? So now we have a line which is going from the center of the watch down the hour hand towards the sun. Then draw a second imaginary line from the center to the 12 o'clock point. So that's the direction it is going. So now you have an angle. So you have from the 12 o'clock to the center and from the center down the hour hand towards the sun. If you bisect that angle, so what is that direction? Take a guess. North is on the other side. South. This is pointing south. Okay. So if you take this angle, this angle from the 12 o'clock to the center and then on towards the sun, using the hour hand, bisect that angle, you're looking at south. So south is ahead of us, north is behind us, that is east and that is west. If you have a general layout of where you are, where you came from, and you studied that on a map, before you left, you would have a general idea about which directions you have traveled and which direction you need to go. But it's extremely easy to get lost because you don't know which way you're going. Every direction looks pretty much the same. One important trick in navigation is to always look at your back, the trail you have just crossed. What will happen is, I'm walking this way and if I turn around, and look where I came from, I'll remember some of the landmarks. If I don't do that, and if I have to track back down this road again, whatever is behind me, which is what I'll be facing when I'm walking back on this track, a lot of the stuff will look entirely new. So when you are tracking back, or even if you don't intend to track back, that's a precaution you need to take in case you get lost. Always look back, identify some landmarks which you have crossed. When you're walking this way, the landmark could be on your left. There could be a tree next to it. There could be a little dugout. There could be animal droppings. There could be a bush. Make note of all these things. So if I have to turn around and go back, I will remember, that's where the rock was, that's where the bush was, that's where the dugout was, and that's the road that I've taken before. And I'm tracking back the right way. That is an essential trick of navigation. Don't just look front, always look back at the trail you've just taken. That way, chances of getting lost or less. Learn to adapt, improvise, innovate, and overcome. To learn more tips and tricks, visit this site. I'm Chandan Lahiri, and I hope to see you soon at the OTS Survival School. Leave nothing but footprints, bring back nothing but memories.